just be prepared because once you hear the song, it's like stuck in your head for like 97 hours after the fact. <laughs> Shout out to Justin Bieber, the Kid Leroy, and also Charlie Puth because I'm pretty sure I heard, I think Charlie Puth produced this song originally for um, Justin Bieber and the Kid Leroy. Massive song. This thing was like blowing up all over the internet. Uh, still is uh, just a huge hit and uh, really catchy. So I'm looking forward to checking out Charlie Puth's version of this song, Stay. Hope you guys are enjoying the content. Best way to support the channel, check out my own original music. If you want to say what's up, shoot me a text. There's two numbers down below, international WhatsApp, regular text message. Send me texts. Let's see what we got. It has a great chord progression. And when there's tension and release, like, you know, D flat major. Oh, we got a little music theory lesson. Let's sit on. Let's start this over. The song has a great chord progression. And when there's tension and release, like, you know, D flat major, flat major, F minor has the, uh, the motion, the, the emotion, and then you're... Bright and beaming with A flat major, and then you're back to D flat. It's just endless. <laughs> it's 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 a truly a gift. Also, pretty amazing how we, like I mean, this is just muscle memory, but it's cool to watch other musicians that like you just they're having a conversation talking about something completely different, playing these chords underneath them, not even looking like they're just completely like separated from their hands. It's pretty remarkable, actually. You want to perform? Sure. Yeah, I would love to. A lot um, of people don't know that you had a part in writing this incredible hit. Yeah, this w I wasn't supposed to um, have a session. Oh, he part. I thought he just produced it. He helped write it. Session or a recording session that day, but I met. Yeah, this w I wasn't supposed to um, have a session or a recording session that day, but I met Kid Leroy, and he's such a talented, talented guy. And uh, the first he he said, "Go to the piano and play something," and this is the first thing that I played, and it turned into this song. Much slower version. I do the same thing I told you that I never would have told you would change. Even when Dude, I his. never could have known that again. But nobody else is good as you. I need you to wow. stay. Need you to stay. His intonation there is like, he's like perfectly on the, killing the song. Perfectly on pitch. Like, per, like especially with. So a song like this is hard because da 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 you is a lot of jumps up and down da 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 is that you you hear for a while and then you jump up and then back down and come back down then you go up jump back but now the problem is if you don't jump up enough you're gonna end up flat and then the whole thing after that will be flat so it's really I it is a tough song with all the jumps so this that was a phenomenal intro let's see keep going I like this chill version. It's like a lullaby version. Feel like you can't feel the way I feel. You keep me right here. He's got such a distinct, very fast, fast vibrato go through his voice. I'll be messed up if you keep me right here. I'll be the same. His head voice falsetto is like really cool. How notice how it's a lot lighter when you go to those higher notes. That's more like the head voice and falsetto part. That's phenomenal. Even the ups and downs and stuff. I love that melody. You know that I da 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 one. I think it's one. One three two one three two. I like that a lot. And you know that I know that I can't, but da da da. Baby, stay. Very close mouth singing. Oh, 
Mm-hmm. Also, notice the tension right in that last. I'll be messed up if you can't be right here. Like, if you ended the song right there, there'd be a lot of tension left and you'd want to hear more. It wants you to go into that chorus. To release the tension. Imagine it didn't resolve. Like, you'd just be like, it has to go into the next session. As good as you and me, just stay. You just stay. I do the same thing. I told you, dude. This fits his voice perfectly. Change even when I knew I never could. I'd know that again. But nobody else is good as you and me, just stay. You just stay. Wow. <laughs> you're, you're amazing. amazing. There's not a lot of room to breathe in that chorus. <laughs> wow. You are, you're panting. So amazing. That's funny. It's an interesting part about songwriting is when, like, choosing sections to breathe like that. Because then, like, in the way that they ch- you could do anything in the studio, but when you go to perform it live, it's like, oh, how do you do this? Now, imagine if that was even faster, it would be even more hard to breathe. I really like that chill version. It's got a really cool vibe to it. You can really listen to what they're saying. Sometimes, sometimes speed you lose the like you lose the lyrics sometimes i feel like in speed and you're, you're just kind of feeling the vibe and and i when you slow down you can really hear what they're saying which is really cool so i hope you enjoyed that thank you so much for watching the best way to support the channel is checking out my own original music as a reminder if you want to say what's up shoot me a text two numbers down below it's uh there's a whatsapp number and a regular number depending on your location i'll see you in the next video have a wonderful rest of your day god bless peace out